I'm back with a Starbucks related video and you're probably not surprised again because you know how much I love Starbucks. This time I decided to spice it up a little bit and since I haven't done a lot of room decoration videos the past summer, I decided to incorporate Starbucks in my room. I really hope you'll enjoy watching it. Also wanted to say that this video is a collab one of my really good friends here on YouTube, Jade, otherwise known as BunnyBell7. On her channel you'll see how to decorate your room for the fall time and I'm sure you will love it. Make sure to check out Jade's video after you watch this one. And without further ado, let's just get into this video. For this first DIY, I'll show you how to make your own Starbucks cups decoration to put right above your bed. So if you have a printer available to you, go ahead and print out any Starbucks cups you want. So for example, I went for more colorful ones like pink, orange, and brown. It's all up to you so you can decide. And then with some scissors, you just cut everything out very carefully. And using a hole puncher, I hole punched all the cups as well as the logo itself. This step is very important, so make sure you're very careful with it. You can put them in any order you like, and then after that, just stick it on the wall using some washi tape, and that's pretty much everything. That's probably one of my favorite decorations because it makes your room pop, and especially for the fall time when coffee is like a must-have. So I'm super excited for this next DIY and what you will need for it is a pillowcase, some transfer paper, and an iron. So I went on Tumblr and found some transparent coffee cups and if I find them, I'll link them down below. And I really like the design of it so I decided to print it out using some transfer paper of course. What I did was just cut out each cup separately and making sure it's all very neat. And after some time, I started ironing each cup separately. Also, while ironing the other images, make sure you don't touch the ones that were ironed already because then it will all mess up and that was actually one of the problems I had. Generally, you can just follow the instructions written on your transfer paper, but mine said to keep each picture for around 120 seconds and that's exactly what I did. I'm very happy with how my pillow turned out and it's one of my favorites right now. And now let's move on to the next DIY where I'll show you how to make your own Starbucks money slash coin holder which is a really great idea of how to recycle an old Starbucks cup. So of course you will need a cup for hot drinks from Starbucks but if you don't have Starbucks next to you of course you can replace it with anything else you want like any other coffee shop cup. Using a marker, I just mark the place where I wanted to cut to make the hole for the money itself. If you want, you can spice it up and decorate the top of it with some washi tape or with a sticker. But I just decided to go with some paint and added some colors on top in the bottom of the cup. You can choose whatever colors you like, especially for the fall time you can go with some yellow and orange or like dark red and something. And I just decided to brighten it up a little bit with some pink and yellow. And you're almost done, just leave it for around 30 minutes to dry out and now you can use it however you want. You can even put it next to your nightstand and it will really help you keep yourself organized with all the coins. <laughs> And this is how Jade's room turned out, so don't forget to check out her video after you watch mine. That's it for today's video and I really hope you enjoyed watching it. If you'd like to see more DIY Starbucks videos, then make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below what's your favorite fall drink. Also guys, I'm planning out my fall series right now, so if you have any specific ideas or requests, then make sure to comment them down below. I'll make sure to read all of them and then respond and I'll see you very soon. Bye!